Hello, Josh Casto, Casto Armory, Casto Armory TV. We're going to be going over the cleaning and care of the Precision Long Rifle. We did just shoot this rifle a little while ago today. We need to clean it. We're going to put it up for the day, probably the week. Like all black powder guns, they do need to be cleaned. One of the biggest issues I hear from customers is, oh, does it have to be cleaned? Yes, they have to be cleaned. Black powder and equivalent propellants are all corrosive no matter what the manufacturer tells you. You need to clean your rifle within 12 hours of shooting it to save your bore, whether it's stainless steel or not. Stainless steel is not immune to the corrosives produced by those propellants. It's not as hard as everybody makes it out to be. What we recommend here at the Casto Armory is Bortex C4 Carbon Cleaner. This is a miracle worker. It's going to speed up the process and it's really going to help your bore get seasoned nicely. I love this stuff. Swear by it and we recommend it for the use in all Casto Armory Precision Long Rifles. What we're going to do here, we're going to open it. We're going to take a squirt of it and we're going to squirt it on some patches. Liberal amount. The first patch will have more on it than the rest. I'm going to take that patch, place it over the muzzle, take our ramrod, and all our ramrods are long enough for you to actually use to clean your rifle, not just load it with. And we're going to work that back and forth. Right, if you notice, it's still long enough to get a hold of so you can clean your rifle and load it with the same rod without an initial investment in mess. And you can see it's a mess. We're going to flip this patch around, right? maximize our efficiency and economy here and hit it again still really cruddy on to patch number two you know work that back and forth You can see that it's just a light gray now. We're only on patch number two. So we're getting it pretty clean pretty quickly. This stuff is just amazing. There isn't a better product for this on the market, in my opinion. And we've been doing this a long time. You notice it gets cleaner and cleaner every time. So we're at two patches. This is number three. back and forth a few times. You notice there's just now just the slightest little bit of discoloration on that patch. And we dropped that one, but we'll just grab a fourth one at this point. Almost no discoloration at this point. We're only on patch number four, and I said five patches and we skipped half of patch number three. Flip that around. All right, we're about done. You will always get a little bit of color no matter how many times you clean it, mainly because the steel itself imparts fine particles on these patches. But that doesn't mean it's not clean. Last patch, this is number five. And as you can see, just a little tiny bit of crud in there. Last side of that patch. And I'll swear that this rifle's clean. This is my personal rifle. I won't have any trouble putting it on the shelf for six months. And you can see there's just nothing, no change in the color at that point. All right, from here, throw the ramrod on the floor. And we're going to kick on a bore light. We're going to show you Casto Armory clean. All right, I hope we got a shot of that. That was a little tough to do. But that rifle is bright, shiny, and brand new on the inside. From there, <coughs> you'll want to pull your nipple because we haven't cleaned the breech end yet. If you're going back into the field and you're going to reload it, you probably don't have to pull your nipple, just give it a nice thorough cleaning with a nipple pick. But since this one's going on the shelf or in the gun cabinet for a while, we want to go ahead and pull that. And I actually will not put the nipple back on it for storage. Right, we're just going to leave that out there. 
clean that. Take a patch. You wipe out your threads. Wad it up. Take a Q-tip. Ream it down in there real good. Get everything all clean. Right? You're ready for the next hunt. Thank you for watching Castor Armory TV. We'll see you next time.